Welcome back everybody to another All Things Nerd video. As always, my name is Nathan. I hope everybody's having a great night tonight. It is Friday, uh, February 10th of 2023, and I'm excited to be off work for the weekend. I don't know what you guys have going on this weekend, but I'm excited to be off it and talking about some games coming up. Talking about games coming up, we're gonna be talking about the Netflix adaption of Bioshock. Um, if you guys didn't know, Bioshock is actually my all-time favorite video game. I love the Bioshock franchise. I uh, it's it's a very special game to my heart, especially with I know many other millions of fans around the world. I cannot wait to watch the Bioshock movie that's going to be coming out from Netflix. Hopefully, it goes through this time because they've they've had some ideas in the past, and actually, the director of the Pirates of the Caribbean movies was going to be behind the original Bioshock movie that was going to come out. It was going to get an R rating, so it kind of fell flat, and I don't think they got the funding for it. I don't remember exactly what happened to the project, but uh, yeah, that's kind of sad to hear. But we have some good news for being Bioshock fans, right? They're coming out with a new Bioshock movie. Before we talk about the Bioshock Netflix movie, I just want to remind everybody, tomorrow, Saturday, we're going to be giving away two free movie tickets for Scream 6. So if you haven't entered that giveaway, go do that. All right, you got you got tonight left. This is it. Um, tomorrow we're going to be releasing a video. Me and Caleb, we're going to be announcing the winner, and then yeah, we're going to talk about the Scream Six movie coming out in March 10th. We're almost there. We're a few weeks away. Can't wait. It's going to be fun. But anyways, let's talk about the Bioshock Netflix adaption. Um, so Netflix has officially announced that they're working on a movie adaption of the video game franchise Bioshock with Vertigo Entertainment and 2K of the Two Take Interactive Software Inc. Here's an everything you need to know um, about the Bioshock movie. So if you guys haven't heard, um, you know, a little bit, you know, what is Bioshock and maybe you're new to the franchise. Well, if you need a quick overview of Bioshock, here's a rundown. First released in 2007, Bioshock is the critically acclaimed video game series that Ken Levine led. The game was set in an underwater city called Rapture and a sequel was released in 2010 that took place eight years after the events of the first game. There was a third game in the series called Bioshock Infinite, which was released in 2013 that took place in a drastically different location in a flying city. And here has here how the uh, franchise is actually described. Set across multiple dystopian and visionary landscapes gone wrong, the series blends sci-fi and horror to pose unique existential and societal questions that reshaped how game stories could be told, all miss pulse-pounding action gameplay that rewards sharp shooting, clever planning, and lethal improvision. Man, I can't believe Bioshock Infinite was released back in 2013. I feel so old. <laughs> I'm not even that old. I'm 28, and man, I feel so old already. Like, ah, oh man, it's what, 2020? 2023, so 2014, 15, 16, 17, 18, 19, 20, 21, 23, so nine years ago. I'm I terrible. I'm, I'm terrible at math, so I just count my fingers. <laughs> I don't know about you guys, but I'm not a good math person. But uh, yeah, that's that's crazy. Um, I, Bioshock is my, like I said earlier, is my all-time favorite video game, especially the first one. And I'm, I'm hoping they do this movie justice. I think they will because, you know, Bioshock's one of those unique games and... It was one of those, it was kind of like a, um, it, it was a masterpiece for its time, right? I remember back in the day, actually, when the first game came out, it won game of the year that year, which it rightfully should have. And then also, you know, playing the game today, it holds up so well. I mean, I've never seen a game that has been so amazing in story and so unique, right? Like, who just thinks of a underwater city that went to crazy, right, with the atom and the splicers and everybody going crazy and then it's just i don't know having that type of storytelling you don't see it today in games anymore uh, one of the things that i am excited for though is um so who's behind the bioshock movie uh vertigo entertainment is going to be doing the main production company behind the movie uh they've been behind movies such as it the lego movie and the grudge and for netflix vertigo entertainment has worked on death note and extinction with upcoming projects the mother starring Jennifer Lopez, due out in 2022, and The Witch Boy uh, is a reborn uh, co-production with Fortis Films. 
um so michael green he's the logan blade runner 2049 and death on the nile is writing the screenplay for the bioshock film and then ceo and chairman of 2k Strauss selnick who also serves as an executive producer on the movie in a statement following the initial announcement said that netflix is among the best and most forward thinking storytellers in all of entertainment today we're thrilled that they share our vision and commitment to the Bioshock franchise, which is beloved by millions of fans around the world. 2K's Cloud Chamber Studio is deep in active development on the next iteration of the series, and coupled with our partnership with Netflix, we remain highly confident that Bioshock will continue to captivate and engage audiences like never before. So yeah, I'm excited. I'm, I'm hoping that this movie is going to be really well. Um, like I said before, Bioshock's my probably my all-time favorite game. And I don't know, what, what, do, what do you guys think? I'm, I'm excited to see the Netflix adaption of it. I'm hoping they're going to do it justice. I think they will. Uh, if they just take their time and do it right. You have to kind of give the movie an R rating, I think, just because of, you know, kind of like the scary and the, not only the scary, but like the, the main plot behind it. You know, you can't really have it as like a kid's movie, but then you can't have it as like a PG-13. So I don't know. We'll see, but it's going to be interesting. So anyways guys hope you enjoyed this video uh, let me know what you think about the bioshock movie coming out i'm excited to watch it and uh yeah if you as if you like this video please like the video subscribe to the channel and comment your comments down below i'd love to hear from you guys anyways i'll see you in the next video take care